conductance is property of conductor again but in this is opposite to resistance conductance g is opposite to resistance that is g is equal to 1 upon r yes or you can say g is equal to i upon v in a conductor so conductance is property of the conductor resistance is property of the insulators non conductors how much they resist the current this is how much they allow the current to pass this is conductance now other thing we study with this is conductivity conductivity so conductivity we have the symbol sigma and this sigma is equal to 1 upon resistivity so this is conductivity and this is property of conductors if we want a good conductor then which property should be good high answer conductivity listen again if we want a good conductor the resistance should be low conductor better resistance low reverse direction we want a property we should increase with good conductor so we say that property is conductivity more conductivity better conductor more conductivity better conductor more resistance better insulator more resistance better insulator so resistance is property of insulator conductivity is property of material what is the difference between conductance and conductivity the same what is in resistance and resistivity okay so conductivity is opposite to resistivity this so this is conductance conductivity resistance resistivity and their relations now we can say uh, the miniature forms of all these quantities which are the miniature forms okay miniature forms of current miniature form of ohms law miniature form of uh resistance miniature form of conductance all for all these we have a small miniature form means what the one which acts on the atomic level these are macroscopic forms which we see in a conductor the whole conductor is visible to us but inside it whatever is there that is miniature form like we see a current flowing in this what is flowing in this current current is macroscopic but if we go inside it each unit length there is a current density that current density is the miniature form okay now we will see the miniature forms of it current i is n e a v d so j is equal to what i upon a this upon a so that is n e v d this is miniature form of electric uh, this is current density electric current density j this is the format of it this i you should not be confused that it is v multiplied by d so let us like this this is only one quantity drift velocity so n e v d is drift velocity this is j now resistance resistance this is equal to v upon i v is equal to e into distance that is length 
I. This is equal to N E A drift velocity. Okay. Now, right. So, uh, the resistance has this form electric field N E A V D. And what is V D equal to? V D is equal to E length N E A. So, drift velocity is equal to E E upon M into tau. Now, see this E is cancelled, this M will go here. So, this is M L upon N E square, N E square A and tau. This is resistance in terms of electric charge this is what density of the electrical charge carriers this we have studied m is the mass of electrons l is the length of conductor tau is the relaxation period and we can write it this way m upon n e square a l upon a this is resistance okay now resistivity resistivity you know the resistivity how it is related to r so r is equal to we know that r is equal to r is equal to rho l upon a r is equal to rho l upon a l upon a so what is rho equal to rho is equal to this so we write here m upon n e square a this Oh, tau. Where is tau? Here is. So, this will be m n e square n e square tau. Tau and a is here, l is here. n e square tau. This m upon n e square tau. This is resistivity. So, resistivity. This is a constant, this is a constant. What is this? Number of electrons per unit volume. And this will change from material to material. Tau. This will remain constant for a temperature. For different temperature it is different. But if temperature is constant, then this tau and this, that is electrons per unit volume. These two are the characteristic which will change from material to material. So, this is property of the material. Therefore, resistivity is a property of material. When we increase the length, anything of this will not change. When we increase the length, resistance change. When we increase the area, resistance change. Resistivity is free of length and area. This depends upon, only upon the material. So, this is j in terms of this e this is r in terms of e this is resistivity in terms of e and similarly we can make it g and this sigma conductance 1 upon r conductance will be this so conductance g this will be equal to any square tau upon m into a upon l conductivity conductivity rho this is 1 upon conductivity sigma sigma is equal to 1 upon rho so this is rho you reverse it this will be n e square tau n e square tau upon m m so these are all the formulas in terms of electrons charge, electrons, mass and number density. So, you should remember all these formula in terms of this. Now, we will see miniature forms of Ohm's law and this miniature form of Ohm's law, this we will do in the uh, next lecture. So, see next lecture for miniature form of Ohm's law. Thank you.